As a solopreneur, my brain never really turns off. That's why I rely so heavily on Trello as my second brain, my personal assistant. Trello literally makes it possible for my brain to get the rest that it needs. Now, there are multiple boards that I rely on throughout the workday, but there's one in particular that I could not live without in my business, and that's the one that I wanted to give you a sneak peek into today. But before we dive into this, make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and ring that little notification bell so that you never miss a tutorial or upload. Okay, so I call this board my command center, but really what I'm picturing in my mind whenever I use this board is Rory Gilmore when she starts her internship with Mitchum Huntsberger and she's just like following him around and she turns into this well-oiled machine. She is thinking what he's thinking and writing down his every thought. And that is what Trello is doing for me. But even better, it pops it back up into my attention at the most appropriate times. It is my source of truth for organizing tasks, tracking routines, staying focused, and it's only gotten more powerful with the new inbox and planner feature. So let me show you around. All right, welcome to my command center. So like most business owners, my day does not start when I get to my computer. In fact, how I start my day, my morning routine is probably the most vital part of the day because it really sets the tone for my level of productivity all throughout the day. So of course, Trello is a part of that equation. My command center is key to helping me stay on track with my morning. I start every day with movement and that's what this move every day list is for. But the best part is that it automatically pulls from this curated list of workout options. It pops over here automatically based on the strategy I have for my movement and keeping things fresh every day. So. I don't have to make any decisions in the moment. Trello makes it easy to take action. Then throughout the day, like anyone, I have daily tasks that pop up at strategic times based on when I'm most likely to have the time and bandwidth to get them done. This list automatically resets and it pops those things up in the right moment so that I don't feel overwhelmed with a massive to-do list. So now where new tasks land when they come to my mind? So as you can see, I do have a brain dump list here. There are times when I will still use this brain dump, but most of the time I am now using that new inbox feature. And so let's talk about that real quick. Whenever any new task pops up, whether it just comes into my mind as an idea or an, a to-do that comes out of a client meeting or things like that, I will just go ahead and jot it in here on the inbox. Or if I'm not at my desk, I'll just do it from my phone. Or if it comes out of an email, I will just forward it on over into the inbox. And then I have time set aside where I will come into this list, triage it, and either schedule things out, add them straight to my hot list, or even snooze them out into the future. Now, we all know that we have daily tasks in our business, but it's not just daily, right? We also have weekly, monthly, sometimes quarterly, and annually as well. So I track those things here as well. I don't focus on content on a daily basis. That's something that I do at a weekly frequency. And so that's what I've got here on this list. I've also got monthly tasks like balancing my business budget. That's something that I do inside of Trello, believe it or not. And it's really helpful for me to have this reminder at the beginning of each month to kind of close out the previous month and get started fresh for the next one. And then quarterly, I do things like review progress of my KPIs, update them as needed to make sure that I'm staying on track and focused towards my goals. And then annually, I do things like setting goals for the next year and, of course, my taxes. Now, let's just talk real quick about the new planner feature and why it's so freaking amazing. So I will come in here at the beginning of each day, or sometimes I do it at the end of the previous day, and I just drag in here all the things that I'm going to be working on throughout the day. You can actually see I'm ahead of the game because I am filming this right now. But that's because things were just kind of running so smoothly this morning that I found myself with an open window. I had energy and I thought, you know what, I'm just going to go ahead and get that film so that I can spend this time editing instead. What I love most about the planner is that it brings all of my calendars into one place. So I have, you know, those little daily tasks spread out throughout the day. I have those one off things that I need to work on. I also have client calls. But you can see I also here have personal things like Puff is getting groomed today, so I need to make sure to set aside time for that. I'm able to see all of that in one place. And when I have something where I need to just take action, I can simply click here, go right into it, and take action without even leaving the board that I'm on. How is that not the most productive thing you've ever seen? So as you can see, Trello helps me stay in control of all of the plates that I juggle as a solo business owner. 
And the addition of the inbox gives me that one source of truth where I can write it down so I can forget it. And the more and more I use the planner, it is becoming a game changer for my personal productivity. The online tools for your business do not need to be complicated and overwhelming. It's time to let it be easy. I hope you liked that video and more importantly that you found it helpful. If you did, please consider subscribing to the channel and sharing it with a fellow solopreneur. And make sure you check out the description for links to how we can connect and maybe even work together.